Good morning, guys. Let's see what Hollywood Studios has to offer today. But before we head into Hollywood Studios, I'm just gonna have you walking with me. Um, I wanted to let you know that I'm going to be hosting a live from Primark this coming Monday. That is September 19th, I think. Um, if you're not familiar with those, I start around 10, 10 a.m. They open at 10 a.m., but sometimes they're, they are a couple minutes late. Then I have to go inside, connect their Wi-Fi. I like to walk around just to see what's really good. Uh, I need to take a picture for the live thumbnail. So I do need a few minutes before I can start. So I always say 10, 10. It could be less than that. So be on the lookout on my channel at around like... 10.05 I guess um, because I might start earlier than that um, but only if I can only if I can if not then you can count on the 10 10 a.m. time for that live all right um, I'm expecting less crowds than last time that I was here hopefully because schools are back in I think everywhere in the world by now I'm celebrating Halloween, of course. I don't understand why my neighbors haven't decorated their houses on the outside. I thought that by now everyone would have done that. I think I was the first one in my neighborhood. <laughs> I think I started that. And um, I don't know if maybe people are waiting for this weekend. Hopefully, I can't wait to see everyone. There are only like two or three neighbors in my area that already have their Halloween decorations outside. Uh, I love it when everyone has decorated, when everyone has those um, inflatables that do things and especially the ones that move. They used to scare my dogs every time. <laughs> there was this one spider, super big spider. And I think it had a sensor, maybe, I don't know, it would move its head when you were walking by. My dogs would freak out <laughs> for little guys. All right, but yeah, I love that. I love to see all the spooky things. I mean, I love to see the houses decorated. That also goes for Christmas. It's not just Halloween. So I'm gonna be crossing my fingers that everyone takes this weekend for that. Uh, all right, I'm gonna turn the camera off because I'm about to go through the security checkpoint and they don't let me film that. I love it when Miki greets you to the park. Oh, good morning, Miki. Where should we start? I think... I think I'm gonna start by oh first thing I'm gonna do is pick up a map for someone she wants it in Spanish so we're gonna do that right now there you go this one is for you girl the first store is the pin store and I do need some pins from there but I'm looking for other things first uh, that I think that I have to hurry up and maybe try and find like some lunch flies for example But I do want to go into this one just because one time I was able to find the 50th blue mugs So I want to see if maybe they have them here Or the Halloween ones, but nope not seeing the Halloween ones and Let's check the 50th area. Oh, they have the vans here so I am going to be looking for those. I think I came to the right store first. I have a request for those vans, so let's check that. Oh, there's more stuff here. All right, this one is new, $36.99 for women. New Crocs, $59.99. I'm gonna get you closer. Uh, vault collection. Then another spear jersey. And does this one have the price? Let me check that. Uh, no, it doesn't. So let's just assume around $80. There is um, a new tumbler. This is uh, $27.99. Then let me see. Let me get this for you guys. Fanny pack with, oh, you can see it here coin purse that hangs from there from the zipper pool this guy's $34.99 and $27.99 for the hat this is what it looks like on the back and so this meshy part makes it breathable and this is like a patch embroidered patch 
These are also new, um, 15 years. Oh, I thought they were like boxers or shorts. It's actually a skirt. Like sweatshirt material skirt, uh, $36.99. And then here on this side, also from the 15th, this Mickey Mouse, this one is cropped, it's $36.99. Beautiful Mickey there. Wow, what about this one? The button-up shirt, it is $59.99. Awesome, I think it's awesome. And here we go, the Vans collection. This is so exciting. So first things first, uh, this is a t-shirt. I'm trying to figure out if it is cropped. I think it is definitely shorter than a regular uh, length one. But I can't really say that it's cropped cropped. It's just shorter than regular. Does that make sense? Let's check for the price. It is $39.99. And then there's a hat here. Well, Disney World, very vintagey looking, right? This one is $34.99. And then down here, we have another t-shirt. So let me see. Let me show you what this one looks like. Oh, that reminds me of um, Coach. Doesn't it look like the Coach hang tags? Oh, I think so. I don't know, I own one and I can't remember, but $36.99. Let's see the back. Oh, <laughs> Mickey and Minnie, I love it. Oh my goodness. Yes, this is such a good one. All right. And here are the shoes. So these shoes look like these. They are $69.99. Look at them. I wonder if they all have the same placement. <gasps> look at this castle with Mickey. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh my goodness. And then the train station. Yes, I am loving them. The t-shirt here, $29.99. That's a very good price, I think. What do you think? Look at that design. Main station and then lots of attractions. Oh, awesome, awesome, awesome. For that price, I think it's great. And then, so that is the front and there's nothing on the back, but then there's another option. This is the other t-shirt, it is wide. I don't think the camera is showing it as wide, but it is wide. And this castle part is like purpley blue. Oh, oh wait, <laughs> it is the same one. It is the same one. Why did I? I did not realize that when I was showing the other one. I thought they were two different ones, but it is actually the same one. Awesome. What you need to know is they are very, very low on sizes, was to be expected, but they might restock, so we'll see. They also have a hoodie with the kangaroo pockets that I like so much. There's a little patch here, Vans. Then we have the castle, it says Walt Disney World. And then let's turn it around, see what it has. Oh, there's nothing on the back, but it does have things on the sleeve. So let me show you this. Let me, okay, wait. Here you go, you can see it better now. These are the attractions on just one of the sleeves. And that's all it has. And I almost forgot to show you the price, it's $69.99. Is this a sticker? <gasps> oh, I think, it, I think it is. I think you can use this as a sticker and it's holographic. I'm seeing that Pandora has new arrivals. Winnie the Pooh collection. Here you go. Oh, beautiful Eeyore, Winnie the Pooh. Then Pooh and Piglet holding hands on a heart. Should I get closer? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know if you can see this one well from that distance. It is really cute. In case you needed a close-up of these two. Tigger bouncing. Really cute ones. And then I also found that they have new spooky styles. So let's see. This one, you can see their front and back. Boo and Minnie Mouse. I like that one so much. Then for Nightmare Before Christmas fans, take a look at this one. And then Sanderson Sisters, of course. We can't forget about them, right? Huge Mickey and Minnie leather plushies from uh, the Coach Collection. You have probably seen them all over by now. And then there's also Goofy. So that's weird. They left Goofy out from every single piece. There's not one Goofy in any of the pieces like this one, for example. This one has 
most of the characters, but they don't have Goofy. But they gave us the ginormous and Goofy plush. I am also seeing that they still have this t-shirt. We saw it at the character warehouse not that long ago. It is $150 here. Then that means that it's probably $75 there. I remember it being $70 something, um, but that gives me an idea that it's probably $75. Beautiful Kiana ears. Now these ones are regular park ears, so they're $29.99. If you remember the green ones that were beautiful, super, super gorgeous, those were bubble bar ears. Very well made, but those were like $50. Um, they're very different, so I can't really say which one is better. Um, I can tell you that those are not available anymore. They might come back, who knows. But I really like the feathers on this one, like the effect of this. Like you, you really do see Tiana there. And then somebody wanted these ones, the pink with the tiara. So um, I'm going to be taking these for somebody. Had we seen this jacket before? I don't think so. Electrical Parade, $79.99. This is denim. Let me turn it around. It comes with pins! I don't think these are removable. No, they're like stuck on there. Um, so they look like pins, they're not actually pins. And these are the three ones that you would get. Let me go back a little bit so you can see the whole thing. And then, is this Pegasus? Is that what it is? Button up shirt, $59.99. Ooh look at this bag the mannequin is wearing it this is so beautiful Ooh, close up of this guy very sparkly very beautiful embroidered well some parts are embroidered this is uh, like embossed I think it's the name of that um, and then look at this part this is nice is this convertible no it's not it's just a backpack uh, $98 for this one it's Daniel Nicole and then there's a mug here oh she looks gorgeous very nice $19.99 it's not the biggest mug uh, some people like that other want other people want like a really big one Otter box $35.99 this is another Daniel Nicole option but this is a crossbody bag Look at this. The fringes. This is um, chains. It's chains. And they do have little stars every now and there. Very nice. This one is $98 as well. Close up of this girl. Let's see the back. Oh. All right. So it has this super short um, shoulder strap. But inside, it has the long strap so that you can wear it as a crossbody bag. More from this collection, Raja t-shirt. It's $36.99. Again, a little bit shorter than usual. And I do like this part. The sleeves are already cuffed and they are a little bit shorter than regular t-shirts. So to me, that looks better. We have a headband here and it is $29.99 but it is also Daniel Nicole so oh it's very lightweight it feels like it's going to be super comfortable that's what it looks like has the uh, the lamp here and then let's check the other side it has a knot here in the center Jasmine hoodie look at this girl oh she looks fabulous here in this one and this guy is $54.99. I'm seeing sizes all the way up to 3X. That's awesome. Then we have this other bag. It's $34.99. I think this one is Disney brand. It is clear as you can see. I'm going to say this is probably like a travel bag. It does have this guy here, the lamp. And um, nothing special on the zipper pulls. I'm seeing on the wall that there's more stuff for this collection so here you go look at that ensemble so the pants are $49.99 and then the top here which says a whole new world in case the camera is not picking that up this guy is $44.99 then there is a tank top down here it's blue and then jasmine and the lamp are embroidered and this one is 
This other one is kind of like lavender tone. It's $36.99. And then I'm seeing a jacket, like a raincoat jacket. So I don't know how to explain the material because it looks plasticky. It's not. It's more like, um, I don't know, like parachute material. Does it say what it is? I don't know. But look at this. The attention to detail. Very nice. I like that it has this cord here at the waist so that it looks a little bit more flattering and uh, this guy is $79.99 can't forget about the ears Ooh, look at those these are bubble bars so they are $49.99 I think I had already shown these at Magic Kingdom but it doesn't hurt to show them again right that will be the back Last item that I'm seeing from this collection is the tumbler and uh, this guy's $24.99 Very very sparkly This is what it looks like from the top and then this is the other side I have a feeling that we had seen this one long time ago, but I'm not really sure if this is a new one Because I didn't buy them when they came out. So I'm not sure maybe those were different Just in case since they have them here to display These ones are by Vera Wang and they are six hundred dollars so maybe if you're getting married here or you're just like bougie and blingy is your thing i mean blingy is everybody's thing isn't it i don't know <laughs> what i'm saying is if you have that kind of money for this girl go ahead they're gorgeous i found two new dresses i can't remember if we had seen the electrical parade one before but mm, i don't remember so i'm gonna show you that one it does say Main Street Electrical Parade here on the belt. This part is embroidered. And let me check. They always have pockets, but yeah, I needed to double check that. This one is very lightweight. It feels like it's going to be a comfortable wear. Let's check the back. And let's see the price. Let's see if this is also 128. Yep, it is. All right, so now let's look at this one. Yeah, you wear this and uh, gotta check the price. Can't always assume things. I've been surprised before, but yeah, this one is also 128, and this would be the back. I couldn't find the back that I was looking for in that store, so let's check this one now. Let me give you a tour. Why not? Oh, okay, so this is not exactly what somebody wanted, but. She asked for something that could match the lunch fly that I got from the character warehouse. Remember, um, one video I maybe I posted it about a month ago, maybe less than that. I wasn't doing a live video, and but I showed that I had gotten some black sequiny ones with I think the front pocket is red with the polka dots. So she said, Is there anything to match? This doesn't exactly match it, but um, it's similar, it goes with it. So $50 for this one. Still having some American merchandise. So here's Minnie Mouse, $24.99. And then the Crocs, that made it very, very late. Oh, wait, this is a D from Disneyland. And I found the Mickey Mouse. This guy is $24.99. And uh, this is the lounge fly wall. This is what they have right now in terms of lounge flies. But they don't have the one that I'm looking for or the ones that I'm looking for. All right, I'm looking for Mickey's main attraction ones. All right, but this is what they have. I know you guys always like to see what they have. And here are some ears that they currently have here. Mm-hmm. All right, so for example, ears like the Pirates ones you need to get from Magic Kingdom. So if you're coming here and you want ears that are specific to a park, make sure that you get them when you are at that park. Otherwise, you may not be able to. Like these ones, for example. These are exclusive. Oh, let me move the Tiana ones out of the way so that you can see this one. So these ones are gorgeous, gorgeous, beautiful ears. These are specific or exclusive to Hollywood Studios because obviously they are made for the attraction Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Gorgeous. This is embroidered. This is so beautiful. How much, are, how much are these? Wait, and look, this is made like the picnic basket. It doesn't say, so can I just assume that these are $29.99? I'm dying for them, dying. 
and then these are also new and also don't have a price so again I'm just going to assume that they are $29.99 Mickey Mouse coming out from that sign and uh, this is the back I found another lounge flight that was not on that wall and I have to show it because how amazing is this? Who doesn't love Mickey Premium Ice Cream Bars? If you don't, I'm judging you. <laughs> With love, but I'm judging you. <laughs> well, looky looky, they also have the Crocs. These are $59.99. And I think we had already seen... Did we? I was gonna say that we had already seen the free jersey, but now I'm thinking it was the pretzel one, the one that we saw. I don't know. Scented. Let's see. I'm gonna show you the back and then I'm gonna try smelling it. I'm gonna get close to it. By the way, look what's making it into my collection. Yes! Yes, it does smell like chocolate. That's what it is. It smells like chocolate. This shirt is new to me. It looks like linen. Oh, Tommy Bahama. Oh, do I want to see the price? It's probably very expensive. $150. That's the back. Let's turn it around to see the front. Beautiful. Currently in the toy section, somebody asked if they still had um, like the park place heads. And I didn't know the answer to that, so here I'm looking for them. By the way, if you ask questions like that, I'm going to give you the answer in the videos and not um, replying to that email, just because this way I get to answer the question for everybody and it's also less time consuming than actually replying to everyone. So the answer to that question for Hollywood Studios is no, at least not at, at this store, but maybe at the other one. And we're gonna go there in a minute. Some wishables that they have here, Dumbo and Pinocchio, it's what we're seeing. They have the 50th Mickey, I'm not seeing Minnie Mouse. And some other open edition ones. I have a few requests for the Tower of Terror lunch fly backpack, so I'm gonna go to their store. I have to go to the attraction and go into their store right outside the attraction and check and see if they have them. Hopefully, let's cross our fingers. We're here guys, Tower Hotel gifts, so let's see, let's check. Oh, I think this is the way out or everyone is coming out that way, so let's go in this way. And see what we can find. Some figurines here. Mickey Indiana Jones. Are you seeing that one? Maybe I should get closer. Yeah. There you go. Somebody long time ago had asked me to get a print. It was a Mickey firefighter holding hands with a firefighter. And I was never able to get him, but if that person is watching, I want you to know that they have this guy, it's $95. Oh, do we have them? I think so. I mean, let me look around and see if they have them somewhere else. If not, I'm gonna ask and see if it's one of those things that they have behind the counter. Oh, no, there they are. They have them here. Lucky, lucky. All right, so we will be getting a couple of these. Let, oh, wait, let me show you. Let me show you. These open or they slide or something. How do I do this with one hand? I don't know, I'm trying my best here, guys. I think that's it, yeah, that's it. And then you can see Miki and Mimi. Let's see the back. Is there anything on the back? Yep, it says drop in anytime and it is $85. I'm so happy that I found them. I can't explain to you how happy it makes me to be able to find things that I know that you guys want and you can't get otherwise. I just remember those times when I didn't live here and I wanted somebody to do that for me. So, I don't know, it's just rewarding. It feels good. And time for our last stop here. Let's see what we can find. What goodies, goodies. I'm seeing 50th merchandise already, but nothing new. What about on this side? That bomber jacket, small and extra small. Are the people waiting for that? Is this, oh, it's a 2X, but it's long. It's a long one, so maybe it's good for um, leggings. 
These came back. I regretted not getting them, but I promised myself I wasn't going to go crazy. But maybe I should. They're so wonderful. Oh my gosh. But you know what? I know that if I buy those, I am going to want to get the bag. And that's a no. That's a no. So maybe not. I have enough ears. More than enough. So, alright, let's see. What do we have here? Oh, I wanted to look at the toys. Remember I told you about the play sets? So let's see if we can find any play sets. Some light up headbands. Hades. And uh, Anger. And uh, Maleficent here. Not sure how much these are. It says brown. I think that that is $30, but I'm not 100% sure. Some dolls. The train. Bubble ones. The Groot one. Just remember, now I have that one at home. Where is it? Where did my little one put it? Haven't had the time to play with it. Why? I have to find it. What else do we have here? Some t shirts. The feeling fantastic. Lots of sizes got restocked, I think. Some backpacks here, and look, here you can also find the Tower of Terror one. But it's okay, I still like going all the way there. And I'm also burning some calories, so why not? Ooh, was not expecting this one here. Then, what else do we have on this other side? The electrical parade one. Another one that I was not expecting to see anymore. Found the collection that I was looking for, the Mickey main attraction. I'm seeing Tiki Room, I'm seeing the teacups, and I'm seeing the carousel. Um, I think I need one carousel one. I needed the small world, but that one, it's very hard to get. <gasps> the key! Oh my gosh, I have somebody who keeps asking for the key, and I can never find them. <gasps> oh, $29.99. I don't know if she wants it at this point because I wasn't able to find any of the other ones and I'm assuming she wanted the collection. I don't know what to do. I think I'm gonna take it, ask her and should I? I don't know. Anyway, I do want to show you this pin in case you are collecting them. This is the newest one, $29.99. I had high hopes of finding the Halloween mug, but I'm not seeing it. It's so sad, so sad. Oh, all right. So I oh, look at Tiana. I want to show you this one. Doesn't she look beautiful? I love her. Maybe I want to go check the new ones. They're um, right behind this. So let me see. Oh, hi, Mickey. He's so adorable. Yeah, let's check the new ones. Somebody said that they have villains um, outfits for them. So I want to see if that's true right now. Okay, I'm seeing some really amazing things. Like really amazing. And first of all, where should I start? This, of course. This. Look at that. I think my new mode needs that. It's $21.99. Oh my gosh. It is amazing. How about this set? Oh yes. Fashion $12.99 for that set. Um look at this. If your new mode wants to be Darth Vader this Halloween, this is exactly what you need. $17.99 for that one. Groot. I don't think I had seen Groot before. Who else is new? She came back. She was here last year. Um, around this time, I guess. We have some princesses. And I believe that somebody had requested that I show them to you. So here you go. This is Rapunzel. This is what she looks like. This one is $21.99. And then she also wanted to see Belle. So here she is. What do we think? I think they did a wonderful job with these. Right? And here is what I was looking for. Look at this one. Very nice. Uh, $17.99. And then we also have this one. I mean, it's not exactly um, like a villain's costume. I thought it was going to be more like that. It's more like... 
um, outfits inspired by villains. So we have this one, also $17.99. And then what about this guy? Very, I mean, that one works as a costume, for Dr. Facilier, right? All right, this one. And uh, Hades looking one. I think they, they did a fantastic job on that one. What do you think? I think Ursula could have been a little bit better, but not bad, not bad. Who else do we have here? Um, a Halloween one, a Halloween outfit. <gasps> Let me open this so that you can see it. Oh, wow. <laughs> that is really cool. Now, this one also has that image, but smaller. And this one does have pants. I really like this one. I need one in small for one of you. So glad that I was able to find that because they only have small and extra small here. And uh, with this, I'm going to be ending this video. This is the end of our tour around the stores at Hollywood Studios for today. I thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.